It has been all about getting to this stage, and two teams have made it. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by Stuart Robson. We're just moments away from kickoff time in the UEFA Europa Conference League final. It's Dior Gordon, and they face Lech Poznan. Well, Derek, we've got two very good teams here. Both like to play on the front foot. Both have some great individuals. This should be a really entertaining game. I'm looking forward to this one. And so the battle commences. Rasmus Schüler. Eriksson with it. And attempting the through ball. And he's found a bit of daylight. Surely. Well, quite simply, that is a wasted chance. Not high quality defending. Magnus Eriksson. Now potential danger. The opening goal and the final. And how important could that be as a direction pointer? Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, but should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Now Christopher Velde. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Surely! Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Short corner it is. Superb block. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Gustav Wickheim. Mikael Ishak. And they know they need to stop him. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Oh, big chance! Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments, and he's proved it yet again. Short corner, let's see. Determined block. Magnus Eriksson. Could be a chance to break here. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. They've given him too much space. It has to be. Oh, good work by the keeper. And now the delivery. Oh, good save. Excellent header. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Well, what a good piece of goalkeeping that was. 
But the equaliser can't be long in coming, surely. Well, unlucky perhaps to be denied, but they've now got to think about defending. Determined defending. And that pass could be troublesome and just has to remain calm. Well, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Now Christopher Velde. Good work to regain possession. Will it happen for them? Opportunity! Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here's the replay, and you see it was a good finish. But the keeper at his near post has to do a lot better. He's got to have that near post covered for me. And with that, the first half draws to a close. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Good looking ball. Now he must favour the cross. Can they convert? And it goes to alter the arithmetic and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect keepers to save everything at their near post, but I think he should probably do better. He'll be a little bit disappointed with that. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Magnus Eriksson. Well-timed tackle. Mikael Ishak. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Alan Czerwinski, Dagerstall, Murawski. Still trailing, but they're upping the pressure. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Options in the middle. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. And a goal kick given. Magnus Eriksson. Well, they might be onto something. It looks as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Mikael Ishak. Oh, lovely incisive pass. Well, the goalkeeper in charge of the situation. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench.
and the short option preferred. Can he convert? Terrific block. Breaking at pace. And they need to get tighter. And they got into that crossing position, but dealt with defensively. Souza. Well, a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Alfonso Souza showing patience, looking for the equaliser. Oh, a vital interception. Now we're inside the final 15 minutes. Is it going to be? Shot attempted, and still danger here. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. Well, that would have been game over. But unless they show more quality going forward, there's just no way back for them. A wonderful goalkeeping moment. Now, well, in it goes! But it will not stand. Offside, Stewart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. Substitution time it is here. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. Body in the way. Oh, fine play, and maybe it'll set something up. Gets in the way once more. And so into the final five minutes. Gustav Wickheim. Can he finish them off? He's done it! What a climax to this game! Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. So there it is. 3-1 the current scoreline here. The electronic board lets the fans know. Three minutes of stoppage time. Souza. And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today.